channel Flora Podel in Nepal Maraming maraming salamat po guys sa lahat ng suporta niyo po sa channel ko so ngayon po 2400 subscribers na po tayo yeah maraming salamat po talaga sa lahat ng mga viewers ko subscribers ipo e yung vlogs ko po ay about po sa trip po namin doon sa New Zealand actually it's an official uh, trip known as Auraki which is the Maori name for it wow and it means cloud piercer wow so we're going to stop just wow. across there oh, yeah, at about yeah. four or five minutes land. and you're going to have an opportunity for a photograph and also to use the bathrooms yeah it's only uh, hosted by the Univers universal peace federation asia pacific so bakit po kami napunta doon guys kasi po uh, it was a preparation sa Asia Pacific Summit po na i-host po ng Nepal. So, 12 couples po kami galing ng Philippines, Thailand, Cambodia, India, Nepal, at saka Australia, Fiji, and Palau. Couples po. <laughs> Po kami nagkakaroon ng meeting at saka conferences po para po preparation sa Asia Pacific Summit noong 2018. So kasama po namin, makikita nyo dyan sa video clips or sa pictures, sina Fiona, sina Divine, uh, at saka leaders po from yeah, the Asia Pacific countries. Nung nandun po kami guys, it's like a dream come true na uh, visited to a place like heaven, literally. Para talaga siyang heaven guys. Lake in the South Island, the second largest lake in New Zealand. It's, uh, it has a shoreline of 333 kilometers, so you pack a very big lunch if you're going to go for a walk around us. Pigilan ng sariling mapaibig sa iyo Ano ba to? So as you can see, there's the uh, water wings You can do float plane flights around Fjordland There's a helicopter operation that will fly you into places uh, Across there Tiano is mainly about accommodation And these I've been hurt before, pero ngayon ay okay lang na hanap yung tiwata na pinagdasal ko sa ama. Ako'y nararahuyo, kapag kasama ka ako'y nararahuyo. Magandang dilag, puso ko yung napihak, wala nang ninanais, ikaw akong labis, oh. Gandang dila Laging nagkaabang Kung saan ka dadaan Nababag ka sa gali Muli kang masulyapan Ang ganda mo At ngiti mong kay Therese Nagkakainis Kasi hindi kita mahalin Hey, ikaw muna Dito ka lang sa tabi ko May gusto lamang ibulong sa iyo Sino ba kasi yung pinagsasalosan mo Sa sampalin ko mismo sa ha- Are you ready? Iman, 
New Zealand, may 26.16 million sheep po. So, marami po yung sheep kaysa people. So, there are only 5.084 million people in 2020 dun sa New Zealand. So, yun ang pinaka-brand nila dun. Yung sheep pati breed meat. Ang sarap talaga. As in, makakalimutan. Sa buhay po. Ang sarap, mahal, basta health. Ang sarap, mahal, basta health. Sabi ng mga Nepalese, pareho din daw sa Nepal kasi mayroong ganito dito sa Nepal eh, doon banda sa Rulpa or Manang Mustang. Basta rin tour kasi ng tour na rin. Third largest city centre park in the world. Oh. And as you can see, there's um, all sorts of field sports play out here. In fact, they do cater for pretty much every field sport that's available to play. Uh, here football, there's even a 12 hole golf course here on the left. So a 12 hole golf course. Uh, and of course, uh, rugby grounds. Who holds the World Cup for rugby? Who's going to have the World Cup, host the World Cup, the next one? I believe Japan is. Japan. Are you going to go and see it? No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> rugby World Cup. It's a game that New Zealanders are very good at. Not much good at anything else, but really good at rugby. Guys, sa New Zealand kasi kunti lang po yung tao at saka man power. So, our driver is our tourist guide and he's also the interpreter of describing this place and that place and he's also selling weather. It's really amazing.
as we get there, just coming up on the right, there is a plinth or a, a cairn, a rock uh, set for hydroelectricity. So there is a, a dam on it and they do divert the water that would normally flow out of the lake. So ang challenges po guys yung travel namin kasi of course it's like a luxury na napunta po kami sa New Zealand and then after New Zealand we stayed 6 days there po pagkatapos ng a couple so husband and wife um amin po yung pamasahi which is really challenging for us because it's a lot of money and then yung accommodation po namin guys na 6 days doon po sa uh, quite vlog ko yung Australia uh, trip namin. So, wala po kami masyado guys na ano, videos kasi during that time ano talaga, nagpo-focus kami sa meeting namin, preparation namin for the for the Asia Pacific Summit. So, yung mindset namin is on the work pero actually part na po part na rin po siya na parang honeymoon na sa couple kasi couple ka po kami nandun. Ayun, sponsored po siya sa organization namin, ng Universal Peace Federation. Pero yun nga guys, ang laki ng gastos namin sa pamasahe. Pero it's a lifetime um, experience. So, para sa amin, mangyayari yun. So, isang business lang po nangyayari. So, parang sa amin, even until now, oh my God, it's like a dream na nakapunta kami doon. New Zealand, is kiwi a fruit or a bird? So, nung binasa ko yung history sa Google at saka I was looking at YouTube, ano pala guys, um, it was... New Zealander is came from the word of Kiwi. Parang mga soldiers po sila guys. Mga, ayun nga, mga sundalo. Pero it was also derived by the fruit Kiwi. The uh, famous brand is actually Kiwi. Which, uh, galing po dun guys sa, sa China yung gooseberry Kiwi. Chinese Kiwi. Pero hindi po dun yung nagdi-derive yung New Zealand Kiwi as a fruit. But, nagdi-derive po yung name ng New Zealander, Kiwi as a bird. Like this. <laughs> Kiwi as a bird. Okay? So, kung may mamimit po kayo guys in the road or in the plane or kahit saan po na Kiwi people, Kiwi actually nagre-represent po siya ng country at saka nagre-represent ng people. So, Kiwi, New Zealander is a bird. So, hindi po sila nagre-represent ng Kiwi as a fruit. Pero yun nga po, uh, dahil gumagawit po sila ng kiwi brand. Like kiwi shoe polish. Kung naalala nyo pa, kiwi shoe polish, di ba? Yung pang linis ng sapatos. Oo, uh, yun. Uh, at saka uh, kiwi brand bacon. Uh, marami kiwi bang. Uh, marami po silang uh, ginagamit na uh, word kiwi. So, uh, the question is, um, kiwi is a fruit or kiwi is a bird? The answer is, Kiwi as a bird. So, tinatawag sila na Kiwi as Kiwi as a bird. <laughs> Kasi po, um, ano po sila, madali lang magka-adapt at saka they were unique and also they were quirky. Maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat ng mga support nyo. Thank you talaga ng million times. Please, kung sino po yung mag-comment dyan down below. Uh, isa shout out ko po kayo next time po. Lahat po nang nag-comments dyan. Um, sana po, hindi pa kayo nakapag-subscribe sa channel ko. Pag new pa kayo, please like. Okay, like. And also, subscribe. And then, yeah, write the comment down below. And please click that notification bell for more updates. Thank you po talaga guys. Stay safe. God bless you. And namaste.